Listen up, boys and girls. It's been 86 days exactly since the apocalypse. Now, I don't know if anybody's out there, but just in case you are, I wanted to make you a little tutorial on how to survive out here. Now, I may not be the sharpest tool in the shed, but I'll keep you alive out here if you stick with me. So let's get started. Now one very important thing when you're trying to survive is having an elevated position on the land. You want to be able to see everything in front of you. Now I picked this crane here because I can see pretty much the whole damn city. That means if any son bitch comes in here, they ain't gonna get their head blown off. Now, I don't like to brag and call myself a professional, but listen here. I'm a professional, so do what I say, and do as you're told, and you just might survive. Now, one important part of survival is finding and maintaining your food and your water supply. Now, in this situation, being in the city and all, I'm a little more grateful, because I got stores and gas stations and, and all these other great things and nobody to fight me for it. So I'm gonna take you to the mini market right now, and I'm going to go over exactly what you need and what you need to look out for when you're scoping these places out. So if anybody finds this video, I hope it's been a great benefit to you and your survival. If you're watching this right now, it means I'm probably still out in these lands, rummaging through gas stations and supermarkets, and now what that also means is that I'm still alive, so if you cross paths with me, boy, you better start running. Join me next time on my quest to find a pocket pussy.